Good day. <clears throat> Today my topic it is breakdown in social mind or social thinking, practice argument using reasoning and thinking skills, critic mind. My topic presents an approach to the limit progress of social mind or popular mind and and weakness. Humanizing of culture in our age, it describes the need of social progress. This micro research is divided in three parts. First one, the human sciences are as area of topic of progress of the human mind. One, the idea of progress and it is different from modernization. Number two, statement what do we call social progress? Number three, describe and discussion of modern life and salt cities of modern societies. Finally, we need to critical, critical views and rational way of life and thinking. What are the key words for this topic? Progress, social progress, social progress, critic, mind, enlightenment and rational thinking. One of the questions often asked is whether the development of social progress. Maybe we can ask ourselves this following question, is change means social progress? Social theorists continue still now to debate the idea of whether current views of social progress or our development of our ways of thinking and life in a matter of civilization's spirit in our age focused on high technology and progress. There are questions about our representation of social progress. I mean, what we call by the term social progress. There is, in, pre, in, in fact, a great importance of the meaning and the idea of social progress. Many people have some kind of chaos about change of lifestyle progress of the social mind, way of thinking or intellectual manner, of re reasoning and understanding rationality or yeah, about things. In, real, yeah, in realistics, if you, the human sciences, teach us the, cru, the true dimensions of social progress, yeah. is social progress real, as it claims, question, or has some fake aspect, or false, ide, false ideology, is approved or, or supported in our actual life, is social mind, progress determined by the high biological, environmental, technological factors, traditional culture and label of our intelligence, shape our social mind progress. In any case, the lack of social mind progress presents the great weakness in our idea about human progress. Human science are not our enemy. Gloria Origin, Steven Binker, in Scientist Manifesto, by saying the humanities have yet to recover from the disaster of postmodern thinking. When a new, it is out of my topic to try or identifying the difference between pure science, technology, and humanities that I think all society needs absolutely of both. I mean, think social progress and technology. Of course, philosophers and humanists are interested in the place of idea within the, within the harder context of the unfolding of civilization or man's stream or world without extreme or dogmatic ideas or ideological aspect of thinking. Philosophers and humanists 
are interested in what has been in 20th century continental philosophy through human condition or the human condition. Finally, big thinkers, philosophers, intellectual scholars, and others in the humanities think that a basic task of their work is acting as critical thinkers. Maybe the pure scientists are not interested in this dimensions. Meanwhile, our consideration that scientists have in their brain, clear idea about the science thinking, that include a huge of critical views about the people, or common dogma, extreme, or fanatic ideas, etc. The humanities are the best way that help us to understand the negative aspects of human thought and behavior. Part one, progress and social mind progress. What is definition? Maybe it is this question and idea of the progress and social progress. The term of social progress exists in the common sense, and this has an ambiguous meaning in public mind. Philosophical propensity assert that, that the human condition has improved over the course of history and will continue to improve doctrines of progress first approved in 18th century. Europe and optimize the optimists of time and place believe in progress flourished in the 19th century. It continues to tell our age, but many 20th 20, 20 century thinkers of project the notion of, of progress often hardens, hardens events such as two world wars, the Holocaust, and the use of nuclear weaponry. We cannot reject scientific and technological progress because this, this concern. Of, um, of making our better life, but we can make too many doubts about them. In case these matters help human beings to make the wars and using the technology for killing and violation human rights, the psychology as a field of the human science tell us too many things about the human evil and disorder as a psychological psychological factors that push a man for using his the progress of science and technology looking at the war matter the idea of social progress all people have some idea about progress and social progress these terms have some kind of relatively in the public mind this paper ties to precisely a typical sense of social progress that concerns the progress of our way of thinking and only and not only lifestyle in many cases in societies of modern world for example especially the traditional and arab societies for example in fact the idea of progress is a major philosophical legacy left by 17th century Oh, yeah, and to the 19th century and to the contemporary social issues. This idea was regarding my references was secular, departing from the medieval, medieval mind, said whether everything could be explained by God, will and it offered a powerful and purpose and perceived super theory ordered and interpreted everything with the life of humanity past present and future the idea of progress became a powerful ideology when was taught as subject of political field yeah left trends in second of the 19th century and the first part of 20th century now statement what what do we call social progress? 
The general encyclopedia, for example, presents the idea of social progress by saying, by, by saying that all societies can or do improve in terms of their social, political, economic, and cultural or intellectual structures for us. We are, we are interested in this paper by the last aspect of social progress. It means the intellectual aspect or way of thinking. In another side, the social progress has, has been advocated by varying so, yeah, realm, yeah, political ideologies with different th theories. My paper is interested by political or ideological aspect that I said presently. Now background about social progress. The social progress has profoundly its real and practical sense, practical sense in the context of area of the enlightenment, the, the lumière in the French language, of Kierung, the big breakthrough to a new idea in Europe was the enlightenment. We social commentators and philosophers began to realize that people themselves could change society and change their way of thinking and life. There was increasing ways for the idea people themselves made their own society. This idea is very clear, but it asks us to following question. How the people could change their way of thinking and changing views? An example from historical background about the social progress, it is the answer of the German philosopher Hegel, when he said, it is by using our reason or by my, by technical words, by logos in the secular or pure rational meaning. In another word, we oppose the technological sense of logos and transform it to have a secular sense. Second idea about the social progress is that by Marxist, the theory Marx described the progress of social progress, which is in your opinion based on interaction between the productive force and the relation of production. Marxism further states for higher yeah, profits and a new marker will inevitably. So the need of its own destruction Marxists believe that in the future capitalism will be replaced by socialism and eventually by communism. But this view was not fulfilled. By the beginning of yeah, the second part of the 20th century, the Marxism has shown us that theory has started to have weakness in application matter. And finally, it shut down completely in 1989. With the breakdown, the breakdown, the situation has pushed one famous American thinker, Francis Fukuyama, built 1952, yeah, for putting his famous theory about the end of the history and victory yeah, of the capitalism and liberalism doctrines. Third idea in the field, I mean the postmodernist theory of matter of social progress. Late 20th century, the postmodernists thought steadily gaining ground since 1980. The grandiose claims of the modernized are steadily avoided and the very concept of social progress is again questioning and secularist. Postmodernism yeah, posits that both dystopia and utopia are the same. Overseeing a grand, yeah, grand narrative with impossible conclusion. Finally, contemporary trends. 
in our our references well, we get a huge knowledge about the social progress various trends of real radicalization which began with the social progress index in the developed by the international organization imperative social progress which measures the extent to which countries cover social progress need of its citizenry. Of course, this field didn't concern our view about the new way of thinking of people concerning world and life. Enlightenment age, or the reversal of the way of the society thinking, this big factor, not an ideology or dogma. It was a revolution of mind in Europe that concerns changing the function of human reason and making out all kinds of dogma or prejudices idea regarding the human and the world. But this transformation of a human attitude didn't go in the real writing way. Of course, no one denies the supreme value of reason and it is ambition to extending of liberty and broken down the myth or dogma of the human minds, in fact, forward to see the critical theory of the critical theory of the Enlightenment, there was in thought in modern history at least two theories about the Marxism and the dialectic of Enlightenment by Theodore Adorno, Marx, Horkheim, Horkheimer, Horkheimer. At the same time, the Enlightenment has become as animists, magic and progress by the many people. That the myth of Enlightenment has to be neutralizing the religious dogma and making liberty and open mind as standards in life and thinking. In another world, the, the new age of reason, in the age of reversal of enlightenment or enlightenment, is not finished the barbarism, evil of human, colonialism, Nazism, fascism, and in our age, this famous age of reason, not finished or extreme, fanatic and radical situation. Finally, we cannot, we cannot be against the Enlightenment is inseparable of making the social progress. It is still a rational way of changing our mind and way of thinking. Finally, the Enlightenment is a philosophy but the philosophy is in its origin till now and critical and attitude. It is a project force for all people to love rational open mind and wisdom. This is the first part. Next part, I continue to, do, to give yeah, my topic regarding the two cases. First one, the cases of traditional societies and second, second case, the next time, it will be about the people mentality or the mass people mentality or another term, the, the rise of populism. Good day and see you next time.